We need a leaner and cleaner state government. As we decrease state spending, we also increase flexibility. So local government and state government have the tools to deal with the reduced revenue. It's true. We are reducing aid to local governments by just over one and a quarter billion dollars. But we're also providing almost one and a half billion dollars in savings through our budget repair bill. Just as we reform our entitlement programs for the 21st century, we must also reform our education system. Clearly, we have to produce graduates who are able to compete, not only with their peers from Chicago or Des Moines, but also from Shanghai or Sydney. And we must do so while we balance a $3.6 billion deficit. That is why, even as we reduce school aids, overall, we give schools across the state the tools to make up for those reductions with even greater savings through the budget repair bill. Again, this is why it's so vitally important for the Senate Democrats to come back home and do their jobs. If they do not, our schools face massive layoffs of teachers. However, if they do come back, overall savings for schools across the state will outweigh reductions, ultimately allowing schools to put more money directly into the classroom.